John, the three-week lead into a Munster final, is that perfect in terms of any team's preparations, but especially for a Munster final? Do you think it's just about the right time? Yeah, listen, it, it's been good to us now, I suppose, coming off the back of the round robin. We've had a chance to maybe take a, a little bit more stock, I suppose, and give guys a little bit of a chance to allow the bodies to heal a little bit, you know. Um, the round robin is attritional from that point, like you're going to lose a few players with injuries during the course of it, so it gives you a chance to uh, not just give them a chance to get back in and get a bit of work done, but those maybe that have a few maybe niggly bits that they were able to play on with, uh, but would rather have had a bit of time to recover with, you know, to give them a bit of chance. So yeah, from that perspective, it's good. Uh, it allows us probably, you know, to park the round robin aspect of and really focus in now on, on the next phase. So, you know, that's, that's really where our work has been at. You've always said when you've spoken about a round robin before, any team can turn anyone over in, in the Munster series. That's certainly been the case this year. Say that again, sorry. You know, you've always said the round robin is, you know, incredibly competitive in Munster. And oh, it's we've tough. always seen how, how teams have turned each one over. It's yeah, been the same, I like it's been really competitive. It's been really, really competitive for us, for us in Munster. And, you know, like, Tipperary gave us a, a tremendous challenge and, you know, really, really tough, tough game for us. Uh, obviously, the game in, in Innes was a really, really challenging game as well from that perspective, you know, nothing between the two sides. Uh, could have gone either way. Um, so, you know, and the two, first two games were really tough games as well. So, uh, great test, uh, great competition. Uh, every day you go out, you know, you're, you're, you're uh, putting it all out there and hoping that it'll be good enough. Well, was it readjusting to the round up in Jan at two years of just knockout? Um, I suppose it's it's just the repeat repeat the the speed with which the games come. Your 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 turnover is is fast. Like last year, we had two weeks between each game, so you had time to do your analysis. You know, your you you were able to maybe just balance the load a little bit over the two weeks. Whereas when you're going in a six day or seven day turnaround, as we were this year, with the, with both pairings in the games, um, you have to get everything done really quickly. So our analysis team, you know, Shani Donald had a busy, busy, busy time trying to turn over the games. And, you know, even having your, your team named on the Wednesday for the match on the Sunday, you're, you're, you're almost naming it in the dark, if you like, because you know that there's some players who have been unable to, pray, to train on Tuesday, but you're hoping they'll be able to train on Friday and be okay for the game on Sunday but you're naming your team on Tuesday night or picking your team Tuesday night so it's gone in on Wednesday. So it's, it's an interesting challenge that way. Um, but listen, we're, we're probably adaptable enough now and experienced enough to, you know, how, to know how to handle it, I suppose, really. And uh, yeah, so that's why you end up with players playing sometimes that are not on the team that were selected because you just didn't know when you were selecting it that they'd be fit or not, you know. So you had to make a call on that later in the week after you'd actually picked your team. Which is a bit ironic. Um, what's it like, I suppose, preparing for Clare for the fourth time in as many months? Um, I haven't thought about it like that, to be honest with you. You know, we'll just focus on the next game. Uh, you know, the fact that it's Clare doesn't really make any difference as such, you know. Um, we're, we're just focused on ourselves. We weren't altogether happy with our own performance the last day. We, we, we felt that we didn't hit a level of performance that we would be. Uh, having set out to, to put in, you know, in, in many respects, you know, in terms of our our, our scoring was low, lower than we'd, we'd uh, normally have, uh, you know, our work rate wasn't as high as, you know, we might like it to be. Uh, it was good, it was, it was very good, but we know that there's still room for for uh, for improvement there. And I think just on, on, on particularly on, on, on Clare's puck out, I think, you know, we, we, were, we were weak on that. And, you know, that's something we'll, we'll, have to, uh, we'll have to go after.